Hey, we're running behind here. We're about to um, go get it though. It's about to be five o'clock, way behind. But we're about to get this money 12 hours today. Uh, we're doing this every day. We're running behind. We started at, uh, we're supposed to start at three. Now it's already five o'clock. I recorded all these videos, but it's all good. We're, we're about to be in the rhythm. I got my Starbucks here. Um, I got the Gatorade in the pocket. We're about to get this um, 12 hour shift done. So today, as I said before, we're starting at five. We're gonna do a five to five. Um, key thing today is to focus on knocking out these 12 hours, you know, keeping it moving. We're about to get in a rhythm. We're about to train ourselves to, um, you know, be comfortable with the uncomfortable, which is long hours, you know, feeling like you're a slave to it. But, you know, in the long run, it's going to be good for us because we're going to um, hit our um, goals, hit the, um, the, get the bag that we want and achieve things we need, you know? So we officially started at five o'clock, 5.01, waiting for our first delivery, actually, or first pickup, actually set for um, Comfort and, let's see, what did it call it? XL and, XL and Premium, or Extra Comfort, but I'm actually gonna switch it over to, let's see if we got one, nope, nothing yet. So I'm gonna switch it over to um, Ride Type, I'm gonna do all ride types for now so I can get the wheels moving kind of be sitting around doing nothing. So yeah, we're gonna do that and see what happens. I got my first ride. It's actually um, a $5 XL ride. So $5 XL ride going like two and a half miles from pickup. So I knocked this out. But I didn't want to put him a blast. But that dude literally had a picture of a white guy and he was like a black guy. Now we're picking up Angel. It's a 7.7 um, .7 mile pickup, 17 or 20 miles, whatever, total drop off uh, distance and it pays 17 bucks. Yeah, they got in talking at all, really. He was chill, chill black guy, that guy right there. Um, yeah, we're cool, we're on to the next. We're at $24 in an hour and 20 minutes. Kind of nasty, but we're gonna keep going. I'm all the way out in West Covina. That's why I gotta like, maybe drive back to LA and have dead mouths, we're gonna see. One thing I hate about not knowing the area, you know, if I knew that I was coming up to West Covina, I wouldn't have took that ride, but like, I don't know the area, so I just took it, because I'm like, oh shoot, $17, I'm gonna take it. But now, it brought me to the middle of nowhere, and it's kind of like choppy. So now I gotta just wait around and hope to get a ride that brings me back to LA because I don't want to get, you know, a bunch of dead mouths and burn gas and all that. So we're gonna see what happens with today. I just got a $3 ride at Walmart. I just passed up the Walmart. We're about to see if this is about to be one of those stupid $3 rides. She got like a whole bag, a whole buggy full of groceries and then she expect me to get out the car to help her load. I'm not doing all that. Actually, I'm not gonna say that because I'm probably gonna help her. We're gonna see. I hate these. These are like the worst. You know, these $3 people, you know, they can't offer a tip in advance. And they're not gonna tip after. After they got the service, they just figure, you know, like, I'm gonna keep it moving. I don't gotta get this man nothing. So we're about to see if this is about to be a person with a freaking bag, buggy full of stuff. And it's always the same people. They're going literally a half a mile away, $3 ride, and I gotta get out, help them load. And then they want me to help them carry it to the door. I'm not doing all that for you. I'm sorry. Not for $3. All right, let's see. Y'all about to, y'all rocking with me. So far, so good. Okay, thank God. I think it's this lady right here. I think she only got one bag in her hand, so we're good. Oh, you're good. Her, but this kid, he got like a couple bags, so we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. I'm headed to LA and I put the destination filter on. I'm 16 miles away. This is just trash. I'm pretty much about to be at like 40 miles driven and $27, so, you know, this is what I mean by you guys just put the hours in, you know. I'm about two hours, about to be two hours in, $27. I'm not mad, I'm not frustrated, it is what it is. Remember, it's not the um, quick money we're looking to do no more, it's about the marathon, it's about the end of the week. Gotta remember, it's about the end of the week, so we're gonna see what numbers we're able to hit at the end of next week, because this week is a wash, you know, what, what we got had going on. So we're gonna see what we do Next week, you know, we're gonna start next week, same thing, working late. Now today, Sunday is slow. Um, this is the slowest season of, um, or period of um, LA driving Lyft. But I'm not gonna be frustrated about it. I'm not gonna cry about it, I'm gonna just do it. I look kind of goofy with these glasses on. I gotta get some smaller glasses. because These glasses make me look like a dork. But yeah, we're about to continue um, rocking out. You know, it's just trash right now, but we're gonna see what's up here. Finally got a ride, finally got a ride, finally got a ride. And I missed the exit because, missed the exit because the freaking um, ride just came. And now I gotta go all the way around in a circle. But it's all good, this ride is $7 for like five miles. I was gonna like, 
make a little extra, but now that I gotta go around in a circle, I'm about to lose some time and money, but it's all good.